Welcome back to my channel. You read the title, let's get into it. Section out the hair at the nape. Make sure you have your duckbill clips to clip in the curls and section the hair into two sections on each side and let's get started. Taking my one and a quarter inch curling iron from GHD, I'm gonna start curling at the base and twisting until all the hair is in the barrel. I'm gonna slowly release the hair into the palm of my hand, keeping the curl intact and then pin it into place to hold the curl. Keep repeating on each side until all the hair is in the pin curls. Your next section is gonna be taken from your temples down in between the nape, and you're gonna section that out onto two parts, two to three parts on each side. Also, make sure you're holding the curling iron at a horizontal angle to create more volume. The more sections you take, the curlier it's gonna be, and the less sections you take, the more kind of wave volume look you're gonna get. Once you get to the top, you're gonna to section in horizontal sections. I believe I separated this into like four sections and curl towards the back of the hair with the curling iron underneath. The bang area I sectioned into two parts with the back of the section towards the back of my head and the front part of the section curling towards the front of my face. This is gonna give it some more movement and volume. While the curl's set in place, you can use a working hairspray. I use this one by Kenra to just spray all over the hair and just wait till it sets and cools down. While you wait, you can do your makeup or watch TV until the curl is set and then start releasing them. Start running your fingers through your hair, take a brush, whatever it takes to start smoothing out the curls and creating the look that you're wanting. For the finishing touch, I just used some Silkeny Mist by Kenra and if you want to have it hold a little bit more, just use a Stronghold hairspray. And that's the look, big voluminous curls at home. I hope you enjoyed the tutorial and I'll see you in my next video. Bye!